guys, what's going on? Ryan here from Rugged Outdoors. The chicks here with me. Uh, good morning. Uh, as you can see, we're driving through Franconia Notch over the White Mountains. It's about seven in the morning. We're headed to uh, Gorham, New Hampshire. Uh, it's about the, s the northern tip of the White Mountains. And we're gonna do a nine mile hike on Mount Moriah. So the temperature is lingering around zero degrees Fahrenheit. I'm supposed to get a, be a high of about 10 degrees, I think, and but the wind's supposed to be down, so it should be a good day. Uh, it's gonna be clear. We should have some good views at the top. And uh, well, thanks for clicking on the video and uh, stick around. trail guys uh, it's cold it's definitely below zero uh, it was cold to start we started about 700 feet in elevation and now we're about 1300 um, we had to get some climbing in and get the body temperature up there because it was cold as you can see we got our snowshoes on uh, the trail is somebody's been up already so it is kind of broken um, it's pretty nice about another 700 feet in elevation to go maybe another maybe another half a mile or so you get into some pockets in the forest here where there's just crazy amounts of snow it's like unreal This 
just awesome. Awesome. You guys, we're almost at the summit. I actually just was doing a live stream for a little bit. Yeah, we had a bunch of people on. Beer Belly Travelers, uh, TSP, Black River Rambler, um, Dark Matter. A bunch of great people. Showing them the views up here, pretty cool. Some of the loyal peeps of Rocket Outdoors. For sure, love all you guys, definitely. Made it guys. Here we are. There's a gray jay up there too. Probably feed some of them. Look at this guy. I know, I see him. There's a bunch of them. No. Yeah. Oh my god. The floor myself now. Take my take my I need a granola. <laughs> They're not going anywhere. Relax. Is the see the gray jay in the tree right there? Oh, it's all, they're all over the place. There's two of them in the tree now. Holy I gotta capture them. All right, guys. Here's the, here's the sights. That's my Washington right there in the distance. Hi, guy. See the gray jay? He's waiting for some food. He's probably going to land right on the camera. Photos can't even capture, really. It's amazing, this stuff. No, this is but, pretty epic. Yeah. 4,112 feet. I need to All right. And we're back where we started. All right, we're gonna uh, get some food, take some pics and stuff, and I'll bring you back in a few. Well, we're headed down, guys. Started getting cold, like really cold, staying there for so long. But we met some people up there and uh, some other Instagrammers. It's pretty cool. So, just heading down. Well, we came down. Now we're back up at the summit at Mount Surprise. Surprise. Looking at the time, probably gonna be walking out of here in the dark. We only got about, eh, maybe about an hour until sunset. So it's not gonna take us longer than that to get out of here. But whatever. All right, we we'll get like some more hair. easy frosty hair. I perfected it. <laughs> You gotta put it across your mouth because it's like a mustache. Ew. A mustache. <laughs> Alright, we got some epic views coming up, I think. So, uh, not epic, but cool. Look at that view, boy. That's a sexy view. Very sexy. This has been a really awesome hike. Super beauty. Super yeah. beauty, boy. Zero. Huh. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> well, they got the temperatures wrong. It was supposed to be zero today. This morning coming in, we noticed that it was considerably colder than zero since the, the thing in the car, which usually runs high, was still reading like 15 below zero. So they're saying the real temps in Twin Mountain, which are it's over there. Um, is what 21 below? Yeah, it's cold. <laughs> Sweet, it's uh like 4:25. The sun's we're getting ready to go down right now, uh, so we got a little bit of daylight left. 
We got about a thousand feet left to, to the bottom. So, should just about make it. Might have to walk in the dark a little bit. Let's see. We have our headlamps if we need them, but I hope we can just walk right without them. We've had fun today. Definitely. So much fun. Um, we spent way too long at the summit, but. Yeah, we did. We met the people up there and. Um, Oh, there's a deer rub on the tree right there. I don't know if you guys can see it, actually. Oh, there's a bunch of them. You can see it right there on that tree. It's all rubbed off. There's another small one over here, too. Right there. That small sapling. You can see that. Pretty cool. Um, yeah, we met some people at the summit that, you know, we know of them. They know of us from Instagram and stuff, so... Um, I know I didn't get to film a toast or anything like that. Um, we did have a beer and a shot up there, and they had, it was a guy and a girl, and they had beers with them too, and so we just, uh, stood up there talking and enjoying the sights. I mean, it was beautiful up there. Um, towards the end, the wind started kicking up, so we're like, alright, time to go. But, uh, yeah, we shouldn't have spent so much time up there. We could have got out of here a little quicker. We're probably up there for an hour, probably. But, uh, but it was fun. Sometimes you gotta do that, you know. All right, enough rambling. Still going. Still getting darker. But we don't have that much further to go. Thank God. Guys, we made it. We yes. just got in the car. Uh, it's still just a little bit light, so we didn't need headlamps. It's uh, 5 o'clock. Well, I'm going to end the video here. I want to thank all you for tuning in. Um, glad you stayed till the end. Uh, stay tuned for more videos, guys. We've got plenty more to come. So, Rocket Outdoors, Fitchick Adventures. Peace. See you on the next one, guys.